Hey guys, this is the second video in my BitTorrent series, and if you guys aren't noobs to BitTorrent, you guys will find this incredibly easy, so go skip ahead onto another video. But basically, this video is just going to be telling you guys on how to actually download a torrent file, how to use a torrent file, and how to get your files at the end of it. So basically, the first step you want to do is go download a torrent file. And the .torrent file is basically a file name, so you could say Avengers 2011 or 12 .torrent. That would be your torrent file. Now what you need to do with that torrent file is put it in a torrent client. And basically the cl torrent client then acts as your way of downloading the file and uploading the file to other people. So to do this, you're going to want to go download your torrent client. If you're on a Mac, you should go get Transmission, that's my personal favorite one. And if you're on Windows, you can go get uTorrent. Uh, as for Linux, I'm not overly sure, but if you do a little bit of Googling, I'm sure you can find your appropriate torrent client. So now once you have your torrent client, what you basically want to do is go onto your torrent website. So let's go onto the piratebay.se. Find your file you want to download and click the little download button. Uh, the Pirate Bay actually uses magnet links, which basically means the the torrent files aren't physically hosted on their servers, so basically they can't be caught for that. So um, that's quite a smart move on their part, but basically click the magnet link, copy that into your torrent client, or if you're on a different torrent site, just download the .torrent file and put it into your torrent client. At this point you should see it should say something about peers, connecting to peers. And basically your peers are other people downloading or uploading the file. So the more peers, obviously, the better your connection is going to go because you'll be connected to more people downloading and uploading, which um, will benefit you, basically. So at this point, that's it. Basically wait it out. And once it says 100% complete, feel free to close down the, t the client if you want to cede to more people so they can download it faster. Feel free to leave it open. But that's it. That's your file. Your file is there. And that is basically the general gist on how to download files through BitTorrent. So hopefully this was informative to you guys who didn't understand that. And on that note, that's it. Catch you in the next episode. Bye.